Hello, Caps Clash. My name is With Honor. I'm here on my main account today, and uh, going to be doing a few things. So I'll just quickly point out some stats on base defense since getting Gunslinger. Um, did the events day? Only got a twenty dollar pack, so I got a little bit to do there. And then I'm going to roll some talents. I got twelve talent refresh cards, and then we'll do enough to get this uh, twenty five hundred gem pack for spend gems and win. So first off, Gunslinger. Just show you the stats online, hero. Still at seven or ten. Don't haven't gotten enough shards yet from double evolving her and taking her newest to nine to ten and all the other double evolves, but we're getting there. That's partly why I bought the twenty dollar gem pack today. You get hundred and thirty gelatinous champion essences, so that should take her up. Eight of eight stone skin. Keep Celeste in honor for now. This is a four or five flame guard crest set. But if I go on to the battle reports, so right here is the third time I got 100% and the people who do it basically use the same kind of team and they drop in the same area. So they got super tanky team. Got a little Nick, Anubis, Michael, some other melee things in there because everyone's up close. There's an Ares. I think the Ares kind of saves them in this a little bit. But yeah, that's the approach. Tanky team, use your magic properly. That's the way to go. But then most people, you know, they drop, they see a war flyer, they back out. Uh, they drop, use all their magic, don't get anywhere, back out. Uh, if they win, they don't get very far, maybe take out a hero, probably more than likely lose a couple heroes, so good on him for that. Again, uh, maybe that guy was just casting a spell, but he had to drop a hero to get 1%, so. Because I've done that for the quest board, just go in there, drop a spell, back out, I and mean, this guy lost. Four Meteor and four heroes, that's a strange combination. But you can see all these defenses is actually kind of a detriment because I mean people don't want to do that. They're not purposely dropping out and taking my resources, but because she's in there, people are just repeatedly attacking and taking resources at the resources. So it might not be a good idea to have her there the entire time. But uh, events today for twenty dollars. Basically the important thing is this 100 essences plus the 30 essences. The rest of this is uh, talent refresh cards and team dungeon cards, which I have way too many of I have to use. But before I collect those, I want to do talent rolls so that I'll still have those uh, 10 plus 3 talent refresh cards. All I really need is a 5-5 five five revite, and one of the heroes I want it on is Trixie Treat, so let's see if we can get it. I mean, the scatter's okay on her because her pumpkin's also scatter, so it's not terrible, but it's not no nothing I would level up. Want a flame guard combination, enlighten. It's not high enough to even think about. One, one, two, one of five, three of eight bulwark. Nope. Three of eight berserk. Blade shell. Nope. At least not four of eight. I might consider a, it was five of eight doing something with it, like a. I've got a stone skin, Michael. There's no reason for a blade shell, Michael. 2 5 Enlighten. What was that? 900? 1200? 1500? 18? 21? 24? No luck. I think that was 8 rolls. Yeah, perfect. So we'll collect those talent refresh cards and get everything else back here. And now go ahead and do the events. Don't have too many to do. There, we spent enough gems for that. It's perfect. Collecting eggs for the next egg hatchathon. So I get to do accumulation bonus. Here's another reason 2,000 is a magical number. 3,000 shards. Or 2,000. $20. The $20 pack is magical. So you get 130 gelatinous champions plus 3,000 shards. It's Perfect deal. Doesn't qualify for gems daily and win, but at this point, all I get from these are Grim Fiends and uh, all I need is Demo Gorgon, so it's not worth it. Alright, treasure chest. I get two of those. Maybe we'll get lucky. Death Knight, of course, and this is a Triantar, right? 40 shards. That's actually better than a Triantar. Not really. You get 200 if I sell it, but I don't typically sell them. 
Lost me bonuses. Oh, all right, here's a Triantar and a Pumpkin Duke. Size Shield Crest 3. I think I actually need those. Honor badges, that's fine. Great Gems Bonanza, obviously you have to spend thousands of dollars for that to be worth it. And don't forget, although you might not see this video on time, they have the Happy Weekend Gift of the Bazaar, so keep your eyes out maybe tomorrow too. And also do your sign-in daily and win. So that met up my expectations. Uh, mostly, I really just wanted the the prizes just from buying the gems, not from what I could get from rolling them or the events, because all I need is one thing, and the odds of me getting it aren't very likely. Well, let me just check out the size shield three. No, uh, oh, that's the two. Okay, perfect. Thirteen. Not the best one. Obviously, I'm missing ones and fours, but it's not a two, so that's good for me. But that's it. Uh, quick video today. Just wanted to get that update in. Uh, see you guys next time.